Hi, I'm Dean Taves with Triple Star Manufacturing and uh, today we'll be looking at the JNM 750 and how to mount. This one's already converted into having the scale put onto it and we will uh, just go over some of the key parts on putting a scale on. Okay, here is the front hitch bar and uh, when it comes without a scale, these six holes are used in here and there's a front plate on there so when a uh, customer wants to put a scale kit on, that plate is removed and then we send a plate along with the kit and that plate we put on the back side of the hitch which I'll show you next. Okay this is the back side of the hitch here and uh, on the front there's a six bolt plate. Take that off, put on this four bolt plate in the back and uh, and you can use the same bolts from the front to the back and then the hitch bar one bolt holds that in there and the reason they put the plate in the back there is so that they can recess the the bar inside there so it's not extending that hitch tongue too far forward so it uh, helps protect the way bar and it also maintains the length for your PTO shaft so it's uh, it's a system that works very well just as a safety reminder to everybody that uh, the safety chain is highly recommended uh, we've seen in extreme conditions where, uh, where even tractor draw bars have, have broken and, and so it's just a good safety practice to have, have that hooked up so that the cart stays with the tractor. Okay, this is the spindle portion of the installation. You have to take the hub and rim off and uh, slide the old spindle out and then replace it with the scale spindle and it's held in by that 5 8 inch bolt there on the 750s JMs it's uh, we use a three and three quarter spindle uh, you get up to the thousand bushel of four and a half and then go bigger you can up to five and a half for the avalanche so this is um, but they're all the same idea there where you slide the old one out put the new one in okay this is the junction box mounted in behind the panel uh, I like to keep it out of the sun, it is a weatherproof box, but uh, over time the sun can deteriorate plastic, etc. And that's just good to keep it out of harm's way. And uh, so three bars go to this junction box and then the fourth wire goes to your indicator.